Hello, welcome to my channel. So I normally do food reviews in the car, but it's really dark outside. And I've done a lot of Dr. Prager. So if you want to see a lot of review on Dr. Prager's and even more reviews, you might want to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you'll be alerted when I come out with new content because I'm always coming out with tons and tons of reviews and I accept requests. So I'll go out and buy the product if I can if you request it, but that's only going to my subscribers, so you have to subscribe. But right now, we're gonna do the Dr. Prager's Black Bean Quinoa Veggie Burger. It's a flavorful blend of hearty black beans, smoky chipotle, and tri-colored quinoa with a hint of jalapeno. Like I said, I normally do reviews in the car, and the lighting is way better, but it's dark outside, so. I went ahead and put in the air fryer, like I do a lot of products, because it's just quick and simple and easy. But this is what it looks like, and it has a really, really, really delightful smell. Like, it is, like, super. It smells like a really high-quality veggie burger you would get, like, in, like, Santa Fe, New Mexico. Because I'm from Texas, so I'm used to Tex-Mex, which is not bad. I actually love Tex-Mex, but this is doesn't remind me of Tex-Mex in a good way, though. It's different. Smell wise. I'm really not crazy about Chipotle. Okay, when you cook this, you might want to cook a little bit longer. I took it out because it was glistening in oil, though. It's oil that I didn't add any oil. Like, it was like sizzling. I'm like, it has to be done now. Okay, around the edge, it's browned really well. Mmm. Another hit. Dr. Prager's, wow. I can definitely taste the Chipotle. I know we don't like the Chipotle. That's the only thing I'm not digging. But I still like it. So it's cooked black beans, water, quinoa, red bell peppers, corn, potato flakes, expeller pressed canola oil. I've said that on my channel before. Expeller pressed is really good. Oil's not good for you, and it should begin with. But if you're going to do oil, make sure it's expeller pressed. And Dr. Prager's, as usual, thumbs up. Soy flour, I've seen that before, and arrowroot powder in his products. Masa flour. Sea salt jalapenos. Cilantro garlic. It is a little bit spicy, by the way. I can feel the heat in my throat now. Cilantro garlic, chili powder, cumin seed spices. Um... But this is what it looks like. And there's like, as usual with Dr. Prager's, there's like a ton of veggies. Mm. You can actually see the little colors of the quinoa. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. There's something I don't like about it though. I like it, but there's like something that I don't like. I'm trying to figure out what it is. It's that Chipotle. You know, I'm not crazy about Chipotle. Let's try it with some avocado, shall we? Do you like avocado? You know, you can make a Vietnamese avocado shake, and if you want to make it vegan, just add a non-dairy um, milk. Mmm. <laughs> That's what it needed. Wow. This is... <laughs> wow. I don't like all Dr. Prager stuff. There's some stuff, Dr. Prager stuff I'm just like, mmm. And there's some stuff I really like a lot. Like the California... Well, you just have to check out my review on that. The California one. I'm just telling If there was no Chipotle in here, I would give it like almost a 10. But you might like Chipotle. And I hate to give it a low score because I don't like Chipotle. 
It's a very well seasoned burger. Like there's a lot of seasonings going on in here. You got chipotle, you got bell peppers, you got cumin. Now, a lot of times when you put too many spices together, because I've added a lot of like Mexican spices together with like um what is it, guacamole, and it's just um this is a really another well rounded burger. I'm gonna give this a solid nine out of ten. I'm definitely one hundred percent gonna buy it again. I'm trying to think it would be good with besides avocado, a cilantro avocado lime dressing on this and a sandwich with extra fresh avocados would be really good. And I've actually made that before with the vegan Hellman's mayonnaise, lime juice, cilantro, and avocado, and cumin. Fresh, it has to be fresh cilantro. But this is black bean, like... That's another thing. I don't like quinoa, but I really like this burger. It's not that I don't taste the quinoa. It's just I don't notice it's there. Like it's something. Mm, I just bet something that's really good. And this tastes like a really high quality. I keep saying Santa Fe, New Mexico because I'm from Texas and it's like Tex-Mex and this doesn't taste like Tex-Mex. I picture going to like a really high-end, pricey, vegan or vegetarian and vegan restaurant in like Santa Fe and eating this with like sprouts and that cilantro avocado lime dressing I told you about and fresh avocado and paying like $15 for it. And no, this is not sponsored and or for Dr. Prager's. But yeah, Dr. Prager's, I hope you know that a business. Like, you got it going on. Until next time, please comment, like, subscribe, and let me know what other foods you want me to try. When you subscribe, hit the bell icon. And I'm going to go back in the car on my next videos because this is weird. I don't like the lighting in here. <laughs> Have an awesome day. Bye-bye.